oh this is so weird you can see me in like the mirror back there but i'm in my living room filming my dollar tree haul because it's a lot better lighting right now and it's comfortable and i can sit on the couch and my shoes are still on so yeah um i would say i actually had a really fun shopping day with my mom i got so much stuff in your company um, I got stuff from Lane Bryan, and I'm really excited about that. So I think I'm going to do a separate haul on that, and probably like a try-on haul, show you guys what stuff looks like. It's Sunday, so it's a Patriot game, yay! Um, today is also the first day I'm trying Dollar Tree nails, and already one of them fell off. So, you know, you guys also remember I work a lot with my hands. Um, I, I work retail, so having fake nails, especially ones from like the Dollar Tree, probably aren't the best idea. But um, the other ones have stayed on okay, just the pinky came off, and I can stand it. This doesn't bug me if the pinky or thumb comes off. If like a middle finger, or, like the pointer finger comes off, that just looks tacky to me. But this, you can't really tell too much of a difference. And these ones have like cute little bow ties on them, so exciting. But I went to the Dollar Tree specifically for paper towels and bleach. And the reason I wanted bleach is because this phone case is insanely dirty. It's a life proof, and I literally just got this and it's so it's like purple blue around the ridges i think it's from me putting it in my pocket all the time um but i wanted to clean it off and the bleach ended up spilling and leaking so i literally i literally set the bottle of bleach right outside the apartment door just because i can't i can't be in here and my hands smell like bleach i just i smell like bleach and it's just not good so um yeah i think that um i'll just use some from my mom or something but anyway so I went to the Dollar Tree and I went to the one that has the frozen food section because I wanted to see if there was anything new but there really wasn't anything that jumped out exciting to me this time but I did spend a lot of money I always spend like 20 bucks there um paper bowls I love these just to like snack on stuff that way I don't have to worry about doing dishes so I I needed paper bowls and I like their paper bowls um, one of the freezer stuff thing that I got was, I got these, there are six in here, it is the swirl sticks, and they are the cotton candy on, there are six of them in here. Now normally the swirl sticks come with a bunch of different flavors, I never like any of the flavors except for the cotton candy, and to get six of them in here is a really good deal for a dollar. So I'm probably going to end up stocking up on those before summer like completely ends, and then the other thing I got from the freezer section was this party cake and it says thick and tasty cake with icing and sprinkles so this is kind of cool I think it's just like a slice of cake um, but I'm very interested in trying this so I think that I'm probably gonna try this after the video and I'll like insert a thing whether it was like delicious or not and then I got a box of Captain Crunch Crunch Berries just because I like to eat plain cereal. Like, I'll literally put it in a bowl, watch TV, and eat it. So, um, I haven't seen this one yet at the dollar store, so I picked up that. So, liked that. And then I went on, like, a rage of gummies. And I found these little red vine twistits. I Like, they have the big bags at Target, but they don't have, like, the little bags. And I like bringing these to work so I can, like, just eat them or whatever while I'm opening or closing just so I can, like, have something to chew on. And I love these red vine things. And then these I used to buy like in bulk, like the big like $20 bags of gummies at Target. And they don't make them anymore. And it's the random um, by Wonka gummies. And it's like no, basically never get the same bag twice. Um, millions of gummies creation. So the every bag is different. There's different gummies in like every bag. And I just love that. And they're so delicious. And what, how many did I get? Three bags? I got three bags of these, so I'm really excited. I'm probably gonna eat one during the game tonight. And then I found the Sweet Tart Mini Bites. So those are delicious. And then I got, I love these, the trolley. Um, these are the Sour Bright, Sour Bright Blasts. They're literally really sour. You bite them and they have sour like juice in the middle. Oh, so good. And then I got another one of these freezer things because Chris really likes them to put on his sinuses and I have one strawberry one and I figured I'd get two just so in case it's a really bad night and he needs to use one and one's already like dethought or whatever. So I got a little crab. So cute. And then this stuff is just some Halloween stuff I got. I got a um, tri like trick or treat cups just you know just to drink like have fun with. Um, there's four of them in here. It's just cute. 
And then I got these because I figured these were going to go really, really fast. And I, I figured I could use them for jello molds or I could use them for ice cubes. So this is pumpkins and these are little skulls. So I figured that would be really fun just to do like jello or something like that. This is one of the Assured. Oh, God, it really smells like bleach. <sighs> I really freaking leaked everywhere. I'm taking this out of the box now. Um, I'm taking this out now. This stinks, stinks, stinks. Um, this, okay. this is one of those cold packs that you can either um, microwave or freeze. So I kind of figured that was kind of cool um, in case my shoulder acts up or something. I'll have this. Just trying to get it in this little bag. It comes in like a little slip bag. So you can like put it like this. Or if his face is really buggering him, you can put it like this. Like either way, it's just it's really good for us to have ice packs. And then I got some elastic support bandage with like the two grippy thingies. In case one of us gets hurt, in case something happens to one of us, I don't we don't have anything. If something happens, we have no band-aids, we have Neosporin, well we have burn cream when I burn my finger from the straightener, but we like don't have anything, so I'm like, that's not good. So I wanted to get one of these just because I, I tend to really hurt myself a lot, and, or I always tend to, I don't know, I always tend to do something to myself, so this seemed uh, handy. And then I got another Advil PM pack. There's four capsules in here, I take one at a time, so this is good for four nights of it. Um, and I don't take them all the time. This is just if I'm really having trouble sleeping. And then they had thermometers. And this is amazing. And I don't, I'm not probably, we're probably not going to use this because we have two thermometers. But I've never seen these at a Dollar Tree. And that's a really good thing to have. So I'm going to ask Maddie if she has one of these. And if she, if she doesn't, she can have this um, for her and Eden. Or like I'll ask my mom or my boyfriend's mom or something. But this, this might, this, this is just really nice to find at the Dollar Tree. So yes. And then I got um, elastic, like little tiny little rubber band things. And then I got some more candy. So way to go me, right? Um, okay. And then in my last bag, I got just a bunch of um, like sassy chic things. I got emery boards because I like to file down the nails a little bit from these and I don't, and I was using a pumice stone and it wasn't working. And then I got some of these, these ones, which are really pretty. It's like a French tip with glitter, like down the middle here. So that's really pretty. And then I also got another white sanding block. I love these things. I just, mine was, my, mine was used up really bad. And then I found this and I've been in desperate need of nail files, like I said, and this is really stinking cool. This looks like, um, this has a glass nail file in it. It's got nail clippers, a cuticle pusher, an actual file, and um like stuff to put between your toes so that you can actually paint your nails um yeah so that's kind of cool i thought this was really pretty this is a really good set i've never seen this kind of set before um i actually want to open it and see Ooh, that's a really really nice nail file Ooh, i like that's a glass nail file i love finding glass nail files and then I found this oatmeal and verbena soap. I just like using these really big soaps. I have the lemon one that, they, that uh, I got from the Dollar Tree already. And I like using these too. Oh my god. The literally Clorox got all in this already. Great. Um, I like washing my makeup brushes and stuff with these soap bars. Because they last forever. And it cleans it. And I know it's, you know, it's pretty good for it. So, And these are really big sizes. Ooh. I'm smelling right now is bleach, but oatmeal. Mm. Oh, you can see the little oatmeal things. Oh, that's cool. You can see the little brown specks of oatmeal. I like it. I like it. Yes, I do. And then I got a thing. A hair ties always get these because Lord knows where these things go. Like from the last Dollar Tree that you watched, they're gone. They're gone. And then I got two fresheners to stick in the bathroom. One is after the rain and one is in raspberry. So that is all for my haul. I guess I'm really excited about the Halloween things. Um, but that's all for the Dollar Tree. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Have a great day. Don't buy bleach. Bye.